What's going on everyone and welcome back to the channel. I wanted to give a couple quick updates on my previous videos and then get right into today's project which I think is actually going to be a really good one. So first off, uh, these robots that I made a video about that some people weren't happy about because I didn't necessarily say all the right things about it or that they wanted to hear. Uh, but I did end up buying one of these. I bought it seven and I flipped it for 12. So I made a five Solana profit. This thing ran all the way up to 18 Solana floor and then dumped all the way back down to a five Solana floor. And now it's sitting at about an 8.4. But look how thin the floor is right now. Uh, you know, it has a little bit of resistance at 9.49, but then after that, it's pretty thin. So I could see these running again if this supply continues to lower here. I may make some videos in the future about how to evaluate different NFTs based off of the supply, price action, how quick it's moving. Right now, there's not enough movement to buy in on it. But if you start seeing this sell every minute, every, you know, two minutes, then that's when you want to start making moves. And generally, you do that within the first 48 hours. But uh, I'll make a video on that in the future. So what I did with that five Solana profit is I went ahead and bought a pesky penguins. I also traded a couple other NFTs. And I've had a very good last two days uh, trading Solana NFTs. So I bought one of these for 6.1. Little pro tip on the pesky penguins. If you wait until after the snowball happens, which sweeps the floor... Uh, these tend to go down in price and it's a good pickup that you can do at that price. So I really, really like this project. This is a long-term hold for me, uh, but it has already gone up almost to Solana. I bought in at 6.1. It's already back up at basically an eight floor. Uh, I absolutely love this project and everything that they're doing, very community driven. So I'm really happy to be a pesky penguins holder at this point. So let's get into today's project, which is Ivy vampires and this is one of the more interesting projects out there because they have an awesome story already uh just kind of how their crazy mint happened so real quick i'll give an overview so they minted yesterday uh they initially minted two days ago and the mint instantly sold out by botters so they refunded everyone and then they set up a fake mint uh with the you know a different mint and the botters got that one and they just took the botters money and then they did the real mint. So they got 40 Solana for their community wallet just by doing a fake mint and getting botters to fall for their trap. So I absolutely love that. And they said that full 40 Solana is going into the community wallet and 100% of it is going towards the project. So that was really cool. So I'll just get into it a little bit. It's a 1,111 supply. It minted for 0 0.25. A little bit of the roadmap, uh, you know, Go all the basic stuff, secondary market. They're on Magic Eden now. They already set up their great verification in DAO day one. That was very, very good. And I like a lot of things that the developers are talking about. So they're pretty brief on the roadmap here. Uh, they're basically already on phase five and they already created a DAO to start discussing the future of this project. And there are some big whales buying in. Uh, I actually bought in at 0 0.48 for two of them, and I got another one this morning for 0 0.67. Right now, we're sitting at 0 0.62, uh, but there are some confirmed whales that are buying in. I won't mention any names, but if you go over here to their Discord, there's several people in here that are Dragons holders as well as various other big blue chip holders buying this project. They're coming out with a token called Garlic. We don't know the use case for it yet, but I do like how the developer is communicating with their audience, their community. Uh, and I really like this post that he said here. A lot of people are saying, oh, we need to set up Twitter raids and stuff like that. He says, we will grow from, or, uh, from our announcements organically. I will not be doing the pump uh, like short-sided stuff such as endorsing raids, endorsing floor talk, or anything. So I like that he kind of has a plan. I mean, they set up everything very fast with the DAO verification. And I just really like like this project. I don't know if it's necessarily going to go up, but whales were buying. One guy bought 50, another guy bought 30-something. Uh, so I think it's worth taking a risk on these. I could see these running this afternoon that's typically when a lot of people start buying it up as long as this supply count stays low there's no crazy fud in the discord uh, i easily see these going up but the price action is still good 
and they've been selling quite a few. So if we go back eight pages within seven hours, that is over, that's like 71 listings right there, or 71 sales within the last eight hours overnight. And this is 7.30 in the morning when I'm recording this. So I could easily see late this morning, early this afternoon, keep an eye on it. As long as the supply count is low, say it gets down to like 150 or below, and the price is pretty good, the floor looks thin, then this could be a really good flipping opportunity today. But like I said, none of this is financial advice. Do your own research. There's not a whole lot you can really base everything off of other than the trends and movement that I'm seeing inside the Discord with different whales accumulating this project. And the supply is very controllable with it only being a 1,111 supply. So that's all I got for you guys in this video. Don't forget the giveaways on my Twitter. Go to my Twitter, sign up. If I get enough people onboarded with this Monday giveaway and there's a lot of traction behind it, then I'll start doing giveaways Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I have a community wallet. Go back and watch that other video that we're just going to be donating NFTs out of there. We have a lot of really big things coming to this channel that I'm excited to share with you guys, including free NFT courses and all sorts of types of other things that uh, we're working out. So, uh, and it's all going to be free. So we're, you know, we're working on a lot of different things right now, and I'm super excited to share it with you guys and share any knowledge that I have with NFTs with you guys. So I'll catch you all in the next video. Go check out Ivy Vampires, see if it's one that you're maybe interested in, and let me know what you guys think about it. If there's ever another project you want me to review, you know what to do. Drop it in the comments below. Catch you guys later.